All right, welcome back. Got uh, another deck today. Your prowess, super fun. Really looking forward to it. So, before we get into it, if you find yourself coming back to the channel, hit that subscribe button for me. It's a small action from you, but it's a huge deal for me. It's greatly appreciated. Helps me out big time. But let's get into the deck. We're gonna run four considers because they're cheap draws. Ancestral Anger because they're again they're cheap cards. Uh, Strangle for a little bit of control and it's a one cost. All that's important. Uh, Soul Partition for a little bit of control or save your own dude man's. Curate. It is a low cost spell for draw and surveil. Reckless Impulse because it exiles cards. Ren's Resolve because it exiles cards as well. Invasion of Kaladesh. It creates a little thopter, but it'll become a huge uh, artifact when you uh, transform it. Pia Nalar, Consular Revival, is the reason why you want to exile. Uh, because when you play a land from exile or cast a spell from exile, you create the little thopter dude mans. Eruth, Tormented Prophet. If you draw a card, exile the top two cards of your library instead, and you can play these cards, which fits in with. Uh, What's her name again? Pia? Pia? Whatever. Uh, Urbrask. Super good card. Sahili. Uh, one of my favorite Planeswalkers. I don't really get a lot of chances to use her. And she fits perfect into this one. All of her abilities will help us out immensely. Narset. So we give everything prowess. Which is <laughs> very obnoxious but super fun. Uh, Chandra. So we can copy spells, get some mana out, and, you know, she's kind of a big deal, so she might help us win a few games. As far as lands, basic utilities, Ganjo, Ottawara, Soak and Zen. But we're also going to run Deserted Beach, Sea Chrome Coast, Shivan Reef, Stormcarved Coast, Battlefield Forge, Sundown Pass, in a plaza of heroes so we can protect uh, a lot of our legendary peoples but that's the deck very excited to get it uh get some matches in so let's, let's just you know screw the talking let's just throw down some cards
Phyrexia to ash. You're toast. I can build it. I can beat you with it. <gasps> Two beauties coming at you. Think swift like a Felidar. Exactly what the metal wants to be. got a super cool edgy name all right let's go ahead and get a white source down let me drop our Pia Pia whatever the fucking name it is who cares hit a ring resolve both of those cards this turn. Blood Tithe. Let's just get rid of that dude. Take the damage from the pain land, but it's best just to get the blood tithe out of there. No oh, fucking attracts though. One of those nerds. Okay. Okay, buddy. Oh, Jimmy's. 
I was wondering if he was just straight Rakdos or... Okay, yeah. Freaking lame. Nerd. Doesn't matter though. He's already dead. Look for your cards, brain dead ape. Your deck is boring. Your mother's disappointed with you. Alright, let's ancestral anger. Do not want that bullshit. But they're gonna give it to us anyway. Range resolved. Where's your Atraxa now? <laughs> oh man. It's like the two worst things. Or I guess three really. So you got your mono red, your fuckboy enchantments, and your keyboard drooling Atraxa players. Lamest things in standard. But that's the deck. Hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Uh Getting on Atraxas is like the, I don't know, it's the greatest. People look at that card, they're like, oh, so much text, it's the best, it has to win. And then you just absolutely shit on them. And then they quit out, because like Mono Red, they're little babies. Little, little babies. But, I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did, so, go ahead and let me know. But, as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Because subscribing makes you feel good.